Hey, what is going on there YouTube? This is the Game Guy and today I'm bringing you to my unboxing for my week 15 items Bean, well, mainly the North Face Expedition fleece jacket, as well as the fact that I picked up the beanie and then the hand mirror, which obviously the hand mirror is still not sold out, but oh well, it's an item to add to the collection. I regret not going for the travel wallet, as I wish I'd looked into what its price would have been before the drop, but that happens. So, yeah, my items arrived on Monday, or two of them arrived on Monday, one of them arrived on Tuesday. The fleece has actually already sold. It sold to somebody who I met at uh, Crep City, or talked to and spoke to at Crep City, who was very friendly. And yeah, it sold to them. So literally, as soon as I unboxed it, it's going to be packaged back up, make sure it's all okay, and sent straight off. As always, let me know down below if your items have arrived from week 15. If they have, what did you cop? What size? What colorway? What item? Or did you cop one of the accessories or bags? Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. And are you going to be stocking, rocking, or reselling what you picked up? Uh, these two items here, being the uh, beanie and the hand mirror, are going to be stocked and kept and worn or rocking for the beanie. And obviously, the fleece has been resold or resold on already. Apart from that, does your item have a sort of set date when it's going to arrive if it hasn't already arrived? And when will that be? Will it be during this week or has it just not updated yet at all? But anyway, let's get into this unboxing. Okay, so obviously here are all of the items. Uh, I was also going to be unboxing my brother's uh, Nike Off-White uh, Zoom Flies in the pink colorway. However, he already opened them, like unboxed them, and has already worn them, so I can't exactly be doing that. But let's kick this off. I am going to go with the non-North Face item, and then move into the North Face items. I believe this all says somewhere on the bottom, I think it's there, fragile. Um, also, since I've been talking about it in, in like every other video, uh, obviously the box logos are going to be dropping tomorrow, and yeah, I have still, I think there's about 600 votes at the moment, maybe more than that, uh, on the sort of community tab where I've set up the voting system. And obviously tomorrow before the drop, I'll be looking at that to see what people have decided. And because there are two different systems, I'll just take the sort of amount, make it like sort of 200% and then just uh, half each of the numbers to get the sort of figures of where the things would be like sitting as of like the sort of list or voting system that I've got. So anyway, first item being the hand mirror, which it says to be fragile with, and it is, should just be a nice, easy opening. I'm trying to keep it turned because the dress part is on this side of the box. These boxes are also really useful, uh, just because of the fact that they do just come in handy to have. Nice, got caught, that's helpful. Uh, they do just come in handy to have when you do want to ship just items overall. So, as per norm, box like a bag or bag, whatever. Still another like unopened sort of one, so that can sit there. We've got a box logo sticker, the sort of norm, and then we have the item. Okay, move that to the side, a bit further, so it's out of frame. So it comes in a uh, like little box that says a uh, hand mirror. FW18 on it, okay. There's this little sticker and I'm just gonna cut it because why not cut it off. Comes in a box and it sits in this little layer of almost like styrofoam type stuff. And here it is. <laughs> it's actually a lot uh, better. It's not the size that I was imagining because obviously Supreme always have this thing where things look a lot bigger than you would expect. So you're expecting like a hand mirror to be like out here sort of thing. But it's not actually that bad to be honest. For what it is, so obviously you have the branding on the back of Supreme and then on the front you've got the little Supreme bit as well. Uh, which the uh, logo on the back is actually wonky, if you can see that, or it's like angled sort of thing. It's not like straight, um, but that's fine, because that always happens with stuff like this. But it's actually a lot better than I was anticipating and in the bit of like styrofoam stuff here. It's got the put, like perfect sort of position for it to sit in. So yeah, I mean, that's another addition to my sort of uh, accessory collection and I wish it had been a bit cheaper, to be honest, than what it was, because it is, at the end of the day, a hand mirror. Um, but then again, you know, it happens with pieces that their prices aren't exactly what you're hoping for. 
uh, happens quite a lot with some Supreme pieces I know. So that is the first item out of the way and done. And now we're going to move on to the beanie. So I'm going to have to turn this box sideways for this, or actually the other way. Give me a sec. I'll put the beanie there. I'm going to have to turn that like that so it's right way up, but it's facing sort of outwards. So the beanie. A lot of people actually wanted the beanies when it actually came down to it, uh, going for them. The black colourway sold out first, then the white colourway went, and then it was one of the other two colourways that went in between that. But yeah, I was extremely happy that I picked this up. Now last week, somebody said that they weren't happy because all I was doing was like, uh, I don't know, like uh, taking a little cut into the bag and then not really like opening it. They wanted it to be sort of like torn open. So that's the best that I'll be doing for you. And now I'll rip the rest. So let's throw the bag away if we can get this out. Yeah, there we go, there goes the bag. And here is the beanie. Holy hell, it's big. Okay, so we've got normal box logo sticker. Can just go to the collection, we'll go into the collection. This is a giant beanie, what the hell? It, um, <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, this is a lot bigger than a normal uh, beanie is. Like, yeah, I'm 100% sure this is way bigger than a normal sort of beanie size. The bag's actually like completely ripped, but it doesn't really matter because I'm going to be keeping it and wearing it at some point in time. But that is a giant beanie. Um, so obviously you have the North Face uh, branding to it. Then on the inside, if we reverse it, you have the little tag that actually only says North Face on it. There is no... Uh, there is no Supreme tag as far as it goes as the fact of what's on here. There is no like Supreme on there. However, on the inside, you've also got like the, the, the like hollow tag that you have on the inside of these pieces or on the inside of sort of North Face pieces. If I get that close, you can see it's there. Um, which, which is good because obviously it's a way to tell between real and fake ones. Um, but yeah, this is absolutely huge. So for the branding, obviously we've got the North Face on there and then all the way going around, it says Supreme. If I can turn it and angle it. So yeah, I think it's pretty cool. It is a cool beanie, um, but it is absolutely huge. Like genuinely, it is a big ass beanie. Like look at that, that is Big. My head looks like the, um, the alien from Alien Predator. Like, that is a big beanie. But, oh well, it's it's a really nice piece. And, you know, another one into the beanie collection, I guess, is the best thing I can say. So yeah, that is, that is going to be joining all of the other beanies that I've, like, collected from this season and past seasons and things. So yeah, there's that one, item number two. So... Lastly, the main item that people are probably watching this video to see is the Expedition Fleece Jacket. Um, obviously, it's sold already, so I'm not going to be taking it out, take it out, but I'm going to be very careful in the way that I do open it so that it can just be packaged back up safely, you know, and so that they receive it, you know, safely, because I don't want them to have any damage done to it or anything, so I'm going to find the perfect place to cut it and just slowly make sure that it just doesn't do crazy damage and just cut it nice and easily but saying that it really doesn't want to cut <laughs> no at all okay now i've got it sort of still doesn't want to cut nice and easily which is great there we go okay so i finally have it open took a little bit of time but obviously just going to package it back up the exact same way to keep it safe so, oh, I really do sort of like regret selling it as well. Like I should have kept it because it is pretty cool. So on the inside we've got a basic, you know, bag and box logo, which I will just leave with it. So you can receive them um, if you're watching this video, obviously. But I need to make sure that I've got this so I can package it up the same sort of way. So, oh, damn, 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 damn. So, the Gore-Tex Cordura Expedition North Face Supreme Fleece Jacket. Ah, oh. Ah, oh, I really regret selling it now. I really do regret selling it. 
That looks extremely nice. <laughs> That's typical, isn't it? That you sell something and then as soon as you see it, it's just like, damn, it looks cool. And it does look extremely nice. Oh well, I know that they're going to enjoy it, so. <laughs> um, but here it is, I'll give you like the up close of it. But yeah, obviously I've seen pictures of people with it on, so, you know, I know what it looks like. Why did I sell this, you know? Because obviously getting it for retail is great, and then selling it on is helpful because like, I'll be able to have the money back from it and then be able to get like other items in the process with the profit. But at the same time, it's really like just dope. It does look really nice, like honestly. Oh well, it happens, you know. Ah, oh, <laughs> I really do regret selling it. <laughs> oh well, that is going to cover this video anyway. I've unboxed my items. Two of them to keep, one of them is being sent straight away. Um, and yeah, that is going to cover this video. If you enjoyed, like, be much appreciated. As I said, if your items have arrived, you know, what size, what colorway, uh, did you pick up or what items did you get and yeah that is going to cover it but damn this is really nice um yeah that's just i i shouldn't have like thought about selling it before i'd seen it in hand sort of thing uh because if i'd seen it in hand it would not have ever been sold but hey ho it happens that is going to cover this video anyway thank you very much for watching hopefully we can get W tomorrow or some W's tomorrow and yeah I am extremely stressed out about that already like not even like before it's happened before it's even like come to the point where it's occurring I'm stressed so yeah thank you for watching I'll see you all next time thank you also for 6,600 subscribers that is amazing we're so close to 7,000 and yeah I'll see you tomorrow for that peace really annoyed <laughs>